All right, let's get into this and how it works. So we're working on 22 and a half degree offset. Well, obviously, not obviously, but in the field, we'll call it a 22 degree offset, even though it is 22.5. So uh, in the field, so this offset, and it's not going to be exact, uh, for, forgive me for those that need it to be perfect. This right here is a 45 degree offset, okay? So we went over that in the last video. This, so your advance and your offset are equal, okay? So this degree and this degree, no matter what it is, if this is five inches, this is five inches because it's a 45 right triangle. So the same principle doesn't apply to a 22 degree offset. 22 degree offset, as you can tell, it's gonna be a lot more sharp, okay? God, that was a really, really bad example. Maybe I'll do that again because, well, that bothered me. So it's going to be, um, this angle is going to be a lot shorter than the actual advance. So your offset's going to be shorter than your advance. So the same principle of your offset, of your advance and your offset being the same does not apply. Uh, you have two different formulas. This one was 1.414. That's a 45 degree offset. This one is 2.613. So these are the two major variables that constants, you should say. So these constants don't ever go away. Uh, it's a mathematical fact. Don't tell me how that works. I'm not a mathematician. But this is if you were to work on a right triangle, 45 degree offset is going to be half. Okay, 45 of this is 90 degrees, 45. And this is 22, which is half of 45, 22.5. Um, so in the field, uh, you do have these offsets because maybe you need to make a smaller offset. Say you're, um, say you're going from floor to floor. You have a, you have a stack that you need to get from floor to floor and you have a penetration here, say you have a penetration here, but you have this, you have your stack coming up this way and a 45 would put you way out here. Okay. So this is too much of a travel. So you're going to go ahead and take a 22 degree offset and you're going to make that work. So the same principles apply in terms of you need to find out, okay, well, how far over, how far over am I um, to get, that's going to be your formula. So let's, again, for the previous example, let's say your offset, which is going to be over here, this offset, this offset is equal to five inches. Okay. So you're going to take 2.613 and you multiply that by your offset. Okay, we'll offset. And if you multiply that, that's going to give you 13, I think, 0. 0.065. Now, in the field, uh, we're not, we, when you're cutting, you know, whether it be cast iron, whether it be PVC, um, obviously copper, you can get a little more particular, but we don't really work in sixteenths. Uh, I'll be honest and go ahead and share that. We usually work in eighths uh, and we work in quarters. Because uh, a lot of difference, when you're coming to bigger pipe, it's it's not going to matter too much. But um, try and be as close as you can. This is closer to a whole number of 13 rather than an eighth. So you take 13 inches is going to be your overall right here. This is your 13. So you're looking at this to here equals 13 inches. Okay. Um, now that's not the only thing you need to do. Uh, maybe some, maybe I'll go over in another video, but then you need to do your takeoff of your fitting. And this is what I have laying out here. So your takeoff is this area right here. Takeoff is basically the distance between center of fitting towards the actual, um, I guess someone call it a hub or basically where the existence of it is already straight. Uh, I don't even know if that makes any sense, but th this makes up a measurement. So you need to calculate um, how much that distance is. Um, for instance, like on a, I know on a, I think a four inch PVC, 45 degree, this is two inches versus a 22 and a half. I think it's, uh, I think it's only like an inch and three eighths or somewhere around there. Uh, so your mathematics are going to be different when you do your takeoff. And that's what we mean by takeoff. So you take 13 inches and let's say we're doing inch and a half and inch and a half. So you're going to have this 40, 22 and then another 22 because remember you have a 22 offset here and a 22 offset here. So you have takeoffs for both sides of the fitting. Um, 
So you take that minus inch and a half plus inch and a half is three inches. So then you have a total of 10 inch piece. And that's going to be your end to end cut. Okay. So the biggest thing you need to learn about 22s and 45s is these are your special numbers. 1.414 is a 45 and 2.613 is your 22 and a half degree offset. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Hope you have fun. Get out there and plumb and love.